Struggle against anti-Semitism. This appeared to be the main concern of the French Jewish community in recent weeks. A day after nationwide commemorations of the Toulouse killings, the French Jewish public could attend a special screening of 24 days, the first film based on the murder of Ilan Halimi, another tragedy that struck French Jews. There were several hundreds to take part in the event held in the cinema publicis on the Paris Champs-Élysées Avenue, a cinema owned by the renowned Jewish businessman Maurice Levy. The screening, like the Toulouse commemorations, was organized again at the initiative of the Council of French Jewish Institutions. Nothing surprising as 24 Days tells the story of Ilan Halimi, this 23 years old French Jew who was kidnapped, then held hostage and tortured for three weeks between January and February 2000 six in a Parisian suburb. His persecutors, convinced of him being rich because Jew, demanded a ransom which was never paid. They eventually abandoned him in a critical condition next to a railway station. Ilan died during his transfer to hospital. The film, based on the book by Ilan's mother, Ruth, chooses to focus on the family's point of view, their suffering and anxiety throughout the 24 days of Ilan's captivity, stressed by the rhythm of an action detective movie. Widely acclaimed by the audience, the film leaves no one indifferent. Now I realize what Ilan, Ruth and his sisters really went through. I don't think I properly understood before. It's terrifying. It's terrifying to see all these anti-Semitic insults. France should feel worried. It's a beautiful movie which sticks to reality, my reality, our reality, everyone's reality, the reason we're here today, hoping this will prevent such things from happening again. It is precisely in this hope that the Council of French Jewish Institutions seeks to combine the commemorations of the Toulouse killings with, on the next day, a screening of the first picture about Ilan Halimi's murder. Both events acting as a reminder of the same plague affecting Jews for centuries and still so difficult to root out. It's not really a coincidence because what happened in Toulouse, which we commemorated yesterday, uh, was the same uh, story in a different way. Uh, Anti-Semitism carries hatred and carries violence and death. The Council has great expectations for the film's success and its educational impact on French audience, not only Jews. Similar motivations seem to have inspired the film's director, Alexandre Arcadi, who, as every member of the Jewish community, was deeply affected by the story. There were those words of Ruth Alimi which resound in my mind and that encouraged me to do the movie. Ruth said during a press conference after her son died, I want my son's death to serve as a warning. This film serves the same purpose. The national release of 24 days is scheduled for the end of April. The movie shows once again that the fight against anti-Semitism remains the main cause of concern for the French Jewish community. This is Piotr Czarzasty for JN1 in Paris.